The objective within this lesson is to find a fraction of a measurement and solve word problems. One quarter of a pound equals blank ounces. Which is larger, pounds or ounces? Right, pounds are larger. So we're expressing a fraction of a larger unit as the smaller unit. We want to find one quarter of one pound. So let's write that out. One quarter times one pound. One pound is the same as how many ounces? Did you say 16? We have our reference sheet to look at as well. So we can replace one pound with 16 ounces. One quarter times 16 ounces. We can find one quarter of 16. We just multiply one fourth times 16. It's a fraction of a set. One quarter times 16 is equal to four, four ounces. One quarter of a pound is equal to four ounces. Three quarters of a foot equals how many inches? I know that one foot equals 12 inches, so I will use this in my calculations. Three quarters times one foot, which is the same as three quarters times how many inches? Right, 12 inches. I could use a tape diagram to help me. Three quarters times 12. Each of those is worth three. So that's three, six, nine. Three quarters times 12 is equal to nine inches. Three quarters of a foot is equal to nine inches. I know that one foot is equal to 12 inches, so it's reasonable to say that three quarters of a foot is nine inches. Mr. Corsetti spends two-thirds of every year in Florida. How many months does he spend in Florida each year? So it's two-thirds of a year. So that's two-thirds times one year. One year equals how many months? Right, 12 months. So let's rewrite that as two-thirds times 12 months. Two times 12 is 24. So we have 24 thirds of months, which equals eight, eight months. So eight months out of the year, he spends in Florida. Eight out of 12, eight out of 12 months. Showing our work another way. Three units equals 12. One unit equals 12 divided by 3, which is 4. And two units equals 4 times 2, which is 8. Labeling our tape diagram a little bit more. And we were looking at two of those units. Two-thirds of the year that he spends. Use the fact that one meter equals 100 centimeters to help you. Pause the video while you do your work. Two-fifths times one meter. Two-fifths times 100 centimeters. Cancel. Cancel. 2 times 20 equals 40 centimeters. I divided by 5 in the numerator and denominator to help me there. 2 fifths of a meter is equal to 40 centimeters. 1 fifth is equal to 20. 2 thirds of a yard equals how many inches? I know that 1 yard is equal to 36 inches. So two-thirds times one yard 
equals 2 thirds times 36 inches equals 2 times 36 is 72 72 thirds inches Two. 2 times 3 is 6, 7 minus 6 is 1, bring down the 2, 4, 4 times 3 is 12, 12 minus 12 is 0, 24 equals 24 inches, 2 thirds of a yard is equal to 24 inches.